All right, welcome to Athletic Republic. Here is our um, parent lobby where the parents kind of hang out and uh, go from there. So let's start with the floor. Um, here's where we get all the agility, ground-based work, plow metrics, jump training, um, all types of movements for specific sports. On site, we do have a therapist. So um, if you're tight, you have problems, or you get injured, we're able to treat you as soon as possible. Um, and from there, they do have the top-of-the-line, state-of-the-art equipment, such as the cold laser, which will help you recover a lot faster if we have any type of muscle problems. From here, um, when you first come in, we'll do about 10 or 11 different um, pre-tests. One is the 40-yard dash. The national average improvement of the 40-yard uh, dash time is two-tenths of a second, which is about six feet of difference um, in speed. So, I mean, you're making a lot of ground up, and you're being able to cover a lot more than you normally would. Okay, so here is our Nike Spark Sensory Training Kiosk. Uh, Nike chose us out of everyone to run their pilot system. Basically, it's an eye assessment for uh, athletes. As you can see, it goes through several tests. If you can see that, visual clarity, contrast, sensitivity, depth perception, and so on. Basically, it compares you against your peers within your sport. So wherever you score, if you score great or lower, we're able to train those areas, such as your ability to change and make decisions, and react and make decisions, eye-hand coordination, and etc. Anywhere you're lacking over here, Again, we're able to improve it. Um, this machine actually tests down to visual clarity of 20 over 8, which means you're seeing very, very clear. If you're not able to see that well, there are six eye care providers in the area that can then help you get to your optimal level of visual clarity. The better you see, the quicker you process, the faster you react. We have a full weight room for athletes who, uh, who need that prior or after a workout session. Here are our um, wall cords, our wall station. Basically, there are hooks on the wall, and we hook up attachments and pulleys and cables um, from the wall to your body, working on different types of movements, such as running, working your um, hip flexion, extension, um, abduction, adduction, things like that. Also, we can attach cords, which I will go into more detail later on for throwing to increase your throwing velocity. Here is our hockey area. Um, athletes will put on their skates. It is a synthetic ice, and they're able to shoot. The score100goals.com uh, is designed and created by Brett Henning. Um, it's just basically based on shot angles and percentages, and it helps you um, learn how to shoot the correct way and which angle to shoot from when you're on the ice. Here is our hockey treadmill. An athlete will get on the treadmill. They'll be holstered in, so they won't have to worry about falling. Um, this treadmill gets up to 16 miles per hour and a 32 degree incline. Athletes have a mirror in front of them. There's also cameras that are um, attached that will show their last run on the actual TV so they're able to learn in every single way possible. Um, I will get more into detail with this later on. Here is our Pro Multi Hip Machine. Basically an athlete will use this to strengthen their hip girdle. The stronger their hips are, the more range of motion their athlete has within their hips, the more productive they are as an athlete. Here is the Pro Implosion. Basically it's an upright bench press. Um, the difference between this one and most other upright bases is this one allows you to work each side individually and the cams, the pulley system is set up to where you're able to move the weights explosively and it also um, decreases the weight as you get towards the bottom part without adding too much strain or stress on the, uh, the joints. Here are our plyo press machines. It's basically like a regular squat press machine but um, you're actually able to jump. Now just like the Pro Implosion, this is designed to where the, the pulley system, it lessens the weight as you're towards the bottom, so it adds less strain on the knees and joints. 
the average improvement for um, the vertical jump for Athletic Republic is two to four inches. Here is our plow floor. There are different patterns. Up top here, there are, this is our four square. We'll have an athlete jumping from one to two, two to three, different patterns. We'll call out different things. Um, and it's about a six inch gap. Then you progress upwards towards the Munoz diagram, which is here in the black. And they're going to jump about 12 to 24 inches. Um, basically, this helps their overall ability to move and change direction. The more control an athlete has over their core, the better balanced and more stable they are to be able to be more agile and quick. The, um, the grounding is about a 30% give, so it adds a lot less impact than the jumping on regular ground. Last but not least, our running treadmills. These are not like a regular treadmill at LA Fitness or the other types of uh, basic gyms. These treadmills get up to 28 miles per hour. They also get up to 40 degree incline. Now, these are very important because what this does for an athlete is um, it allows them to perfect their sprinting mechanics. Um, when you're getting on the treadmill, you are running at a set speed. The good thing that helps that out is when you run, your body tends to slow down. It, ju it just happens. When you're running on the treadmill at a set speed, your body cannot slow down. Yes, you will start to um, have less range of motion, things like that, but you're going to find a way to maintain that speed. So the benefit of this, our national average is up to 50% longer endurance rate, which is, you know, a huge part of all types of sports. Even if you're in a sport that you do not run, it is essential to have a higher um, cardiovascular endurance rate. Um, I suggest that all athletes come in here either to train or to do some of the core training, or even if that, come in and at least do your Nike um, the Nike Sensory Training Assessment to figure out how well you see.